Well, hey YouTube, so today guys, we are back here with another review, and today we have a review here. This is a bristle featherweight bagless vacuum, guys. So if you're somebody who needs a vacuum, but you're trying to do this on the cheap, but you don't want to compromise with unknown brands with warranty policies that don't exist, right? That's one thing I'll say about the Dirt Dump. It's an unknown brand, and I don't know, some people just like to go with the mainstays. You could actually potentially see this in a Best Buy or a Bed Bath & Beyond. Like a, a Dirt Devil, for example, is really just an online only type of item, you know? So this is kind of like their competition. This is kind of like their response for more of the mainstream brands here, guys. So yeah, this is a bag list vacuum, which in this price tag of about $20 to $30, uh, it's pretty much imperative. You don't see bags on stuff like this. I mean, the whole bag concept as a whole is kind of dying off, which is good because, you know, it's kind of a pain to have to worry about that type of stuff. But yeah, it's, it is cool to see this product do this. It's a really cool concept, the whole bagless trend. Uh, if you want, guys, this is the handle. The handle is probably about three feet, I would say. Uh, there's a little switch right here. You kind of just push up on this like that. It's actually really easy to do that. And you could use this to theoretically extend this if you wanted to, although it wouldn't be very secure, but it's really meant to just take off. But maybe if you're trying to get under underneath a table or something like that, I could definitely uh, see a purpose for that. I, de I definitely could see that. Uh, also guys, if you take off this piece right here, this is kind of where the, the main cavity is. Don't wanna, don't wanna mess with that stuff too much. I am allergic to dust and uh, that type of stuff, so I'm not gonna mess with it, but you can go down there. Unfortunately, there's no kind of mini mode where you can kind of just vacuum up. I mean, you could do it like this, but there's no little handle. You know how, I don't know if you guys ever saw my review of the uh, Rocket uh, vacuum, but that has that ability. You could just pull off a piece. You have a little small piece, you can undo the little nicks and cranny. This product, you can only do it like this, which I guess is okay, but to be honest with you, it's kind of garbage. I wouldn't suggest doing it. You're really gonna have to put this in here. Um, another thing, another problem with this product is over time, this thing can get actually pretty loud. Uh, mine, this, you would hear this thing, it's definitely a lot louder than it used to be. I'm sure if you were to clean this thing out, you would definitely get better returns on that, from that department, but it's just something to keep in mind. It is pretty loud, it's on the louder side, and even before that, it, uh, definitely was. It definitely was on the louder side, unfortunately. Um, also, there's only one type of, uh mode here it's just on and off uh there's no real uh one two three level you know three is for more of the higher level stuff you need to get more of that thick stuff on your carpet or stuff like that while level one could just be a simple crumb uh you know stuff like that one's always going to be the lightest they won't be as loud but it still will be loud but for a product like this it doesn't even matter to be honest with you uh also, this piece, if you look up here, guys, you can see some gluing down here. Uh, unfortunately, this, kind of, this handle kind of fell apart over time. Once again, guys, uh, unfortunately, in this price range, you're, you're going to have to pay the price somewhere, you know. And if it's not the uh, materials they're using, it's the durability of the product, you know. So, unfortunately, that's just kind of the reality here. But without further ado, guys, I think it's time we use this thing. I mean, there's no real way for me to show you exactly which particles it picks up better than others, but I can show you how loud it is. I can show you how efficient it is in doing its job. And then you can make a decision based on those factors. And I'll also tell you how it does in my opinion. Like I said, guys, it's more of your level one experience. It's more about the uh, the crumbs and stuff like that. That's what I would compare this one to. But it does a good job. I'll be honest with you, it does a pretty good job. We're going to hear how loud it is too, which is probably one of the bigger problems with this item. Alright guys, we're back here, and that was kind of my quick little test here of the product. I think it sounds pretty good. Um, I have no problem with the way it sounds. Um, I actually thought it was louder than it is. It actually is not as loud as I remember it. Potentially somebody in my family must have uh, cleaned up the bag in there, although not the bag, but whatever you call that thing. And it seems like that must have helped. It must have helped it because it doesn't sound so bad. Um, I did a good job with the crumbs, the small crumbs in my room, which I have no way of showing you, you know. But overall, guys, you know, I'm not going to make this too long. If you need a budget vacuum and you want to go with a more verifiable brand, something with a better warranty, 
uh, more brand recognition stuff that you probably have in your house for Brissa already, then you can't go wrong with this product here. Um, guys, the Amazon link will be down below. Make sure you check it out. The international link on GearBest will also be down below. Check out the Peebos t-shirt, 50% off on gear, on my website. Sorry. Also, guys, the, website, the video has come out first on my website, peebosonline.com. So my, my uh, t-shirt and my uh, video has come out first there. And make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, favorite, put on notification bell, turn off ad block. And yeah, check out my girlfriend's amazing content as well on this channel. So yeah. Thank you and bye. It's a good it's a good product. It is. I like it. And yeah.